Hey y'all, um, so I'm in my car again and I just wanted to pop on real fast and say, um, basically say happy 4th of July. I know it's not until tomorrow, but with everybody, you know, doing stuff with family and I know I'll be doing stuff with my family tomorrow, so I wanted to hop on and say happy 4th of July. And I also wanted to remind everybody that it's not all about the burgers on the grill. That's reality. It's, um, you know, our country's Independence Day. So I wanted to make sure that I brought that to your attention again. I know that most of us know we've learned it in school. And, um, sometimes we forget. And so I want, I wanted everybody to think about that and basically, I guess just bring it back to your attention so that we can be thinking about that tomorrow. And while we're enjoying our family, it doesn't mean we have to sit there and, you know, do any kind of, I mean, as a homeschool mom, do a big lesson with our kids or something, but, um, but it would be nice to maybe, you know, have it on our mind every now and again, and especially right before, and um, just think about why we get this day off from work, and that's why I'm going to work today, is because I get tomorrow off. So, I'm going to enjoy my day off tomorrow, and I hope you guys do too. I hope you guys all get a day off. And if you're in an occupation where you do not get a day off, then thank you. Because whether you are, you know, a doctor or a policeman or fireman or there's lots of different occupations that basically, I hate to say it, but lack of better words, are too important for nobody to show up to work that day. So somebody's got to be there every single day. And we also need to think about those people on our, on our, um, barbecue picnic days, whatever you want to call, you know, those kind of days. But I hope that, um, y'all are going to enjoy your 4th of July. Um, be careful in the sun. And just a little tip, Young Living does have sunscreen now. Um, we, we have a couple of different ones with different SPFs. And my kids will be wearing that tomorrow. I've never used, I, I never used to be a really good reapplier for sunscreen. And I, and really the first applier, I, I sometimes forget, especially for myself. You know, we'd go to the beach. I used to live down in Florida. Not anymore. Now I'm Ohioan. But, um, and I would, you know, maybe sometimes do the first Okay, guys, lather you up with sunscreen. Of course, it's full of chemicals, and I didn't think about that. I didn't. I wasn't educated in the way I am now um, with the chemicals. So now that I'm aware of it, I'm definitely looking for more natural alternatives. And thankfully, um, most of my alternative changes have have been all in one place. If if somebody has you know, a, a brand has all these different things that you need, it definitely helps. So, yeah, sunscreen, also um, bug, you know, like insect repellent, they have that, which is great. I always use the citronella oil, but um, they do have insect repellent, and so trying to think what else can I say about tomorrow because you know by the time evening comes you might have a bonfire or something like that you're, you're doing s'mores is what my kids really would like to do tomorrow and do a bonfire and have s'mores um by then you know the little bugs are coming out and they want to bite you so um you know the bug repellent is nice insect repellent. Um, let me think here. Keep your lavender handy because during those kind of picnics, sometimes we 
let our guard down and before we know it you know we're at the grill and we do a little burn and guess what I use for my burns lavender oil or you know if you end up with a sunburn because you did not put your sunscreen on thankfully Young Living also has the after sun spray um, so that's something to look into Another thing, make sure you start in your day with Ning's Red because that is your full fruits and vegetables. It's really more than what a lot of places recommend even. More fruits and vegetables in one day than what is technically recommended is kind of nice. Um, it, it helps overall body wellness. Every body system gets affected by Young Living's products. So whether you're an oil guru like I am and run to your oils for everything or you're looking for some other natural products Young Living is definitely the place you want to be if you have any questions on that please give me a holler if you um, you know message me or um, comment on this video then I can help you out right away um, but you guys be blessed have a great day Enjoy your families tomorrow. Enjoy your kids. Enjoy your spouse. And think about the people that can't be there. You know, that don't have the day out. Military folks, they, um, they spend a lot of time away from their families. And they... And most of them, I think that if you ask them, they would do it again. And the families would say yes. You know, most of them, they know what they're there for. And I appreciate them. I'm very thankful for them. I have friends and family that are in the military. And they do a really hard job. And just leaving your family to go miles and miles away and leaving them during holidays, leaving them during, you know, school events for your kids. You, you know, there's people that don't get to see their kids' school play or their kids' rehearsals for dance or, you know, their sporting event. So, yeah, think about these ones that don't get that day off. All right, guys. Um, keep peace, peace and calming, young living, peace and calming would be a good one to keep your peace, stress away, I love it, it's daily, daily perfume right there, alright, well, I have to go, so I'll talk to you guys later, thanks.